Spent 24 hours, I need more hours with you Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Candy Ray, and I know you guys click this video because you see all this hair and it's popping. But, anyways, this video, as you can see from the title, I'm showing you guys how I got this color. Not necessarily how I curled it because I didn't do that in the video, but I'm showing you all the details and how to get this. But before we get into all that, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. I'll give you some time. I'm pretty sure you subscribe. If you're not, I'm mad. But anyways, please go ahead and keep on watching. All right, y'all. So I got this hair from Melissa on AliExpress and it came regular 613 so and I already opened it so it's that's not exactly how it came but it was nothing special all that came in the thing was wig caps and I already used them so I had one on my head and the other one ripped so yeah that's how the hair is it's 26 inches and it had it comes with four combs not that that really matters because I don't really care about the combs to be honest you know what I'm saying but yeah so I'm about to dye this hair because I do not like the raw 613 hair so to do that I'm about to use four boxes of Revlon hair dye I use two dark ash blonde and then I use two medium ash blonde and I just mix one of each and because I did two separate mixtures because the bowl couldn't hold enough so I did one dark ash blonde and then one medium ash blonde in each so yeah that's basically what I'm doing right now just mixing the dye and yeah I'll be back <laughs> so I'm just applying the dye directly to the hair I didn't use a brush or anything I just had my hands and had gloves on and I just literally took the dye and part parted the hair in sections and applied it to the hair but this could waste a lot of dye so if you want to save money set so you don't have to get as much dye please use a brush or something because I almost ran out of dye I had to start minimizing how much I was picking up later because I was doing it like this I was just grabbing random amount and putting it on the hair so yeah that's just what I'm doing parting it in sections and applying the dye so I'll be back As y'all see, the hair looks super dark. I'm not gonna lie, I low key got scared. I was like, uh, what is this? And uh, I was like, and uh, oop. <laughs> but I was like, okay, maybe when I wash it and blow dry it and all that, it'll get lighter and look more like the color that I want. 
but I was scared when I saw that. I was like, this is not what I'm going for at all. So I use a shimmer light shampoo to kind of to wash it because you know that shampoo be kind of lightening slash making the hair silver. So that's what I used to wash it. But then when I washed it and it looked like this, I was like, all right, I did not quite want silver hair, but let's see where this goes. So I'm just blow drying it and then I'm going to see what color. It, well, you guys saw that it actually came out into a cute color. So I was just blow drying to see what color it was going to turn into so yeah this is was this was just a roller coaster for me i don't i don't know oh i look crazy excuse my my face baby girl but yeah i'm, I'm just blow drying the hair so nothing crazy nothing crazy <laughs> After blow drying it and flattering it for a little bit, uh, it came out a pretty decent color. It, I liked it. It wasn't. I don't know if that I was really going for that color, but it was okay. It was alright. Uh, it was acceptable. Let me say that. So I'm just putting on. I I put on my wig cap. Wow, I look crazy, crazy. I put on my wig cap. That, but I put on the foundation that was darker than me, and I'm also putting the same foundation that's darker on the lace because I want it to go from that brighter from that dark to light contrast so it looks more natural because I feel like I just feel like when you do that with blonde hair or lighter hair it looks better so now I'm just putting the wig on my head nothing special the same old way if you want a detailed video on how I do that go check out my older wig videos or comment below and tell me that you want one so I can make another one but yeah, I'm just spraying the glue and then I'm going to just lay it. So, see you in the next clip, guys. this is the final look it's super cute I love it I love this color I'm so proud of myself like I thought it was gonna be mad gray cuz when I was doing it I was like what what's that who's putting that on not me but as I dried it and flat ironed it on all that good stuff it came out pretty nice I actually love this color and I think it's super cute with my skin tone so let me know what you guys think below if you want to see a detailed video on how I got these curls baby <laughs> just leave a comment down below and I'll do that video for you guys and please make sure you hit you 
like this video, comment what you want next, and follow me on Instagram at Candy Ray. The same name as this, as my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video, which will be soon. I promise you this time. I promise, I promise, I promise. Love you guys. Mwah.